I wanted things to obviously what is look. Suture? Suture, like suture uh, a wound, like you're sewing it. Oh, suture. Um, See, she really is a she doctor. She knows her stuff, yeah. <laughs> well, you don't want me operating on you in real life. <laughs> You will die. <laughs> but Zia, Zia is the woman. I trust job. you with my life. I do. You should not. I do. <laughs>booking this amazing franchise edition. How does that feel? Feels good. Not real. Feels good yeah. and not real. Yeah. <laughs> amazing. Uh, so, you usually play, I feel like you usually play like a kind of a cool, tough guy. Not so in this movie, but what was right. that like? Um, yeah, I think, uh, I don't know if I usually play a cool, tough guy. <laughs> Um, Maybe you just seem cool and tough. Oh, well, thank you very much. I, I'll take that to heart. But, um, <laughs> yeah, it was really fun to play Franklin because I got to explore his vulnerabilities, his, his sensitivities, and, you know, I, I got to really just, you know, let it go with the, the yells and the screams. Um, <laughs> so that was cool to explore. And also I had a lot of fun uh, being scared constantly by J.A. who wouldn't tell me when things were going to happen so he could get a real response out of me. So all of those reactions were just genuine. A lot of them. A lot them. of them are. That's awesome. Yeah. A lot of them. <laughs> it must have been a tense shooting environment. <laughs> no, yeah. it was so much fun. I had a lot of fun. I, as an actor, I loved that. I love that he was like trying to help me out. We describe it like we were just at camp. We were at Camp Jurassic. Yeah. That's and perfect. It was awesome. That's where I feel like I am right now. We are now. Camp Jurassic. Yeah. We're yes. legit Camp, camp Jurassic. Jurassic. <laughs> and yeah. Daniela, you got to have some real veterinary experience. Yeah. So tell me about that. Um, I got to work with this veterinarian in London who had worked with African reptilian wildlife, uh, who basically taught me how to, you know, puncture skin, uh, you know, it's it's thick, mm -hmm. how to suture. Um, I wanted things to obviously look- What is look suture? Suture, like suture a, a wound, like you're sewing it. Oh, suture. Um, See, she really is a she doctor. She knows her stuff, yeah. <laughs> well, you don't want me operating on you in real life. <laughs> You will die. <laughs> but Zia, Zia is the woman. I trust job. you with my life. I do. You should not. I, do. <laughs> I gotta ask if you guys could genetically engineer a dinosaur and have it do anything you want, what would it do for you and would you name it? I would never do that because <laughs> I think that is inhumane and not right to interfere with nature and the natural process of evolution. Uh, and to counter <laughs> that argument, I'm going to say let's do what we do with poodles and pigs. Breed them smaller, cuter, chubbier. Love it. More That's fishy. terrible. Yes, That's make them cute. Was I love this this dichotomy. It's I know. amazing. I know. It's just like the film, isn't it? And on that, actually, we did learn since Jurassic Park came out almost 25 years ago that velociraptors and a lot of dinosaurs were a lot fluffier. Does that does feathers make them scarier or, cu or cuter? It makes observing birds more interesting and oh. like it it I look at birds in a different way now. Yeah, I think if I saw a T-Rex with feathers, I would be more scared. I, I think I would be yeah. that's a giant chicken. I mean, think about it. There are sharks in the teeth. ocean that are huge, right? You got mammals like marauding grizzly bears, but we don't have like, you know, it coming from the sky. Like that yeah. would be really giant birds. Giant birds. Good. I want to be terrifying. Absolutely. Yeah.